Welcome to Money Matters. Here we summarize financial books and provide valuable conclusions at the end. Our book summaries offer practical and actionable advice to help you achieve your financial goals. Subscribe and hit the notification bell to stay up to date with our latest videos. Introduction The Total Money Makeover is a personal finance book written by Dave Ramsey that provides readers with a step-by-step -step plan for achieving financial freedom. The book is based on Ramsey's own experiences with debt and bankruptcy and offers practical advice on how to get out of debt, build wealth, and live a financially secure life. In this summary, we'll explore the key concepts and strategies presented in the book and how they can help readers achieve their financial goals. Chapter 1. The Total Money Makeover Challenge In the first chapter of the book, Ramsey lays out the Total Money Makeover Challenge, which is designed to help readers get out of debt, build an emergency fund, and begin investing for the future. The challenge consists of seven steps, including creating a budget, paying off debt, building an emergency fund, and investing for retirement. Chapter 2. Denial. I'm not that out of shape. In this chapter, Ramsey explores the common tendency to deny the seriousness of one's financial situation. He encourages readers to take an honest look at their finances and acknowledge the extent of their debt and financial challenges. He emphasizes the importance of facing the truth about one's financial situation in order to begin the process of getting out of debt and building wealth. Chapter 3. Debt Myths. Debt is not a tool. In this chapter, Ramsey dispels common myths about debt and argues that debt is not a tool but a trap. He explains the dangers of high-interest debt and the negative impact it can have on one's financial well-being. He encourages readers to avoid debt whenever possible and to focus on paying off any existing debt as quickly as possible. Chapter 4. The Total Money Makeover. A Proven Plan for Financial Fitness. In this chapter, Ramsey introduces the Total Money Makeover Plan, which is designed to help readers get out of debt, build wealth, and achieve financial freedom. He outlines the seven steps of the plan, including creating a budget, paying off debt, building an emergency fund, and investing for retirement. Chapter 5. Saving Money. The Power of Consistency. In this chapter, Ramsey emphasizes the importance of consistency when it comes to saving money. He encourages readers to make saving a priority and to set aside a percentage of their income each month. He also offers practical tips for saving money, such as cutting expenses and avoiding impulse purchases. Chapter 6. The First Step to Financial Freedom – Save $1,000 in One Month In this chapter, Ramsey introduces the first step of the Total Money Makeover Plan, which is to save $1,000 in one month. He explains the importance of having an emergency fund and offers practical tips for saving money quickly. He also emphasizes the need to prioritize saving and to make it a regular habit. Chapter 7. Finish the Emergency Fund. Kick Murphy Out. In this chapter, Ramsey encourages readers to complete their emergency fund by saving three to six months worth of living expenses. He explains the importance of having a fully funded emergency fund in order to be prepared for unexpected expenses or job loss. He also offers practical tips for building an emergency fund, such as automating savings and avoiding unnecessary expenses. Chapter 8. The Myth of the Rainy Day Fund in this chapter, Ramsey dispels the myth of the rainy day fund and explains why it's important to have a fully funded emergency fund. He argues that unexpected expenses are not a matter of if, but when, and that having a fully funded emergency fund is the key to financial security and peace of mind. Chapter 9. Debt Myths, Debt Consolidation, Debt Management In this chapter, Ramsey tackles common myths about debt consolidation and debt management. 
He explains that while these programs may seem like a good solution for managing debt, they often do more harm than good in the long run. He emphasizes the importance of taking control of one's finances and paying off debt as quickly as possible. Chapter 10 of Mice and Mutual Funds Why You Shouldn't Be Investing in Individual Stocks In this chapter, Ramsey explains the dangers of investing in individual stocks and emphasizes the importance of diversification. He encourages readers to invest in mutual funds, which provide a diversified portfolio and reduce the risk of losing money in the stock market. Chapter 11 From Fruition to Tuition Prepare for your kids' college education without going broke. In this chapter, Ramsey offers practical advice for parents who want to save for their children's college education. He emphasizes the importance of starting early and offers strategies for saving money, such as using a 529 plan or investing in mutual funds. Chapter 12. Retirement. Be financially healthy for the rest of your life. In this chapter, Ramsey emphasizes the importance of saving for retirement and offers practical advice for building a retirement fund. He encourages readers to start early and to invest in low-cost mutual funds that provide a diversified portfolio. Chapter 13. Real Estate and Mortgages. How to Buy Smart and Avoid Foreclosure. In this chapter, Ramsey offers advice for buying a home and avoiding foreclosure. He emphasizes the importance of buying a home within one's budget and offers strategies for paying off a mortgage quickly. Chapter 14. College Funding. Put your kids through college without going broke. In this chapter, Ramsey offers additional advice for parents who want to save for their children's college education. He offers strategies for finding scholarships and grants and emphasizes the importance of encouraging children to work and contribute to their own education expenses. Chapter 15. Dave's School of Graduate Personal Finance In the final chapter of the book, Ramsey offers additional advice and resources for readers who want to continue their journey towards financial freedom. He provides a list of recommended books and websites, as well as advice for staying motivated and focused on one's financial goals. Conclusion 1. Debt Out of Debt The first and most important step to achieving financial freedom is to get out of debt. Ramsey recommends using the debt snowball method, which involves paying off debts from smallest to largest, to gain momentum and stay motivated. 2. Build an emergency fund. To avoid going back into debt when unexpected expenses arise, it is essential to have an emergency fund. Ramsey recommends saving three to six months' worth of expenses in a separate savings account. 3. Live below your means. To achieve long-term financial success, it's important to live below your means and avoid lifestyle inflation. Ramsey advocates for creating a budget, sticking to it, and finding ways to save money on everyday expenses, such as groceries and utilities. He also suggests avoiding debt and paying for big purchases with cash whenever possible. Until next time, you can think how do our own beliefs and attitudes about money impact our financial success, and what steps can we take to shift our mindset and create a more positive relationship with money. Thank you for watching Money Matters. We provide valuable insights on personal finance through book summaries. If you enjoyed our content, please subscribe and give us a thumbs up. We offer videos in multiple languages, including Spanish and Hindi, to help more people achieve their financial goals. Leave a comment below with book suggestions or topics you'd like us to cover. Check the description for our affiliate links to help support the channel. Thanks for your support, and we'll see you in the next video.